The resource pack contains all of the code of the modules that we build throughout this video series, and it's available to anybody who's currently a subscriber or who has made a previous purchase. A couple of things to note about the resource pack. First is that if there's any errors that come up in these videos, they'll be corrected in the resource pack so you can see as you follow along where there might be an inconsistency or an error. And secondly, as I mentioned before, I use a progressive copy and paste method in order to build on previous examples as we go through an entire video or chapter. The way that this is structured in the resource pack is that inside of the modules, there's a folder called steps. And in the steps folder, there's a collection of files that are numerically ordered that contain the code for each step. And each one is prefixed with the name of the file that it affects, and then a short description, and then it ends in a dot step extension. It ends in that extension consistently, so you can train your editor to color code the step files just like they would PHP because most of the files are going to be PHP. Most of the step files contain the code from the previous example with some code added to it. So if you want to see what's changed from one step to another, you can use a diff comparison tool in order to see the changes. In Mac, you could use a program called Text Wrangler to compare the two documents. In Windows, you can use a free program called WinMerge. The resource pack comes bundled with the DVD, but if you purchase a collection for download or are using the web interface as a subscriber, then you can download it in the download section of the site.